Well, folks, we're here with Mr. Steve Naylor. How you doing, buddy? Super. I got to apologize to you. I've, I kind of went AWOL here for the last couple of weeks. And well, I was out of town for a little bit myself, and uh, um, so your apology is accepted. I Thank gotta, you. I didn't even say we were going to talk about this, but you had a major crazy thing over there in Dayton. Uh, with softball, with with people getting yeah, you know, ugly stuff, yeah, huh? it really was. You know, we've been talking about the travel softball and different things on your other program, and uh, we did have quite an experience uh, with a, a little shooting altercation in our hotel. Uh, oh my goodness! All the kids were okay. The most importantly, and um, we uh, we ended up moving to another hotel, but. Uh, yeah, and you played it good was, softball. Oh, we played great softball. Yeah, so, we're yeah. we're gonna have Steve on here in a couple of weeks on our, our sports show that we're gonna be doing at 8:30 on Saturday nights, just talking about kids in sports and you know to keep them active all throughout the uh, the summertime here. But speaking of active, this house uh, you guys did this uh, a few weeks ago here, yeah. just a beautiful job, and I know the uh, Christie family is really happy with what you're able to do. Yeah, it turned out really nice. Um, you know, they had some definite uh, flashing issues and some issues around their uh, their uh, their soil stacks and stuff. And we took care of everything. It was a complete tear off, and uh, the shingles are all back down and sealed real nice. And um, turned out to be a great job. Got it all cleaned up really nice. And you know, it, it took us just a little over a day to do the job. So. Well, we you know we shot footage back then with all of the tear off and everything. And that's the thing I think that scares a lot of people. It's like, oh my gosh my roof is going to be unprotected for X amount of time and how do you go get through that? You know, uh, first and foremost we keep a really, really close eye on the weather. Sure. And if there's a greater than 30 percent chance of, of it raining, you know, typically we're not going to tear off right. unless we've got a garage we can do or something off to the side that everything, you know, just kind of ties into itself and we can, we can protect it. Um, so uh, we, were, we were blessed with great weather when we did yeah. the job. Yeah. Um, and uh, we, we, we got in and out, and we do not tear off more than we can re-shingle back in that very same day. So we're just, we're just real careful about what we do. Well, you speaking know. of careful, and this is one of the things, you know, you see these, these uh, uh, A, 5A's roofing companies, you sure. know, they come out here and everything. Sure. And, you know, I feel so bad for some of these guys that are up on the roof and everything because I'm falling off two roofs, okay? <laughs> now, the safety that you guys put into when you have your guys up there, I yeah. think that is just it's just awesome for what you guys are able to do. Yeah, um, safety is first and foremost. Um, we try to comply with everything that OSHA, you know, after you get over five feet tall, we just try and comply with absolutely everything we can. Um, no matter how fast you can get a job done or how beautiful it looks, you know, at the end of the day, if your guys aren't going home safe, nothing really matters, you know. So we really, we want to do a great job for you. It doesn't have to be done in one day. We don't have to rush through anything. And, um, you, know, with, you know, setting up for safety is just, it's, it's crucial with Seagate. Sure, um, sure. And, and most other companies don't do it. You no. know, they just... They, they take their chances. No, it's a roll of the dice. Um, it's a roll of the dice if the guys are even insurable that are up on your roof. Um, but we do have a $2 million insurance policy. Um, and uh, our guys are, you know, under compliance at all times. This is, uh, this is, this was kind of uh, the secondary room. I, I know there's things that uh, we've talked about, and hey, and Giacomo, our cameraman, just kind of giving eye a little shootout to that great flashing work there. I mean, it's, it's just, it's so clean and everything looks good. So one of the things we had to do here is this is, was an addition to the home and it tied in uh, to the home, tied right into the side walls. And whenever you uh, come to a, you know, a side wall like that, it has to be flashed with L-shaped metal. It's called step flashing and it's sure. overlapped and then counter flashing on the top of that. A lot of companies will, when you see in their quote where it says we're going to seal this or seal that, most of the time what they're really talking about is just putting a bead of caulk or actually using like a tar, right. which is something that we do not do. Okay. Anything that can be flashed properly can be done with rubberized materials or metal. Um, depending on what, what uh, circumstances you have in the field. But, um, so a counter flashing and a step flashing is what this called for. And that's again, that's what we did around the chimney. Um, you'll, uh, you'll see that the, 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 the step flashing, the counter flashing is cut right into the brick. And um, it works a lot better. It, it's the yeah. only way to do it. It's the old school way to do it. When, whenever you see anybody spreading tar or saying they're going to seal something, just be yeah. leery of that. It's um, not the proper way to do it. 
And last thing before we let you go, because I know you're crazy busy today. We are right now. Yeah. I know we've got in the next couple of weeks, you've got some uh, basement uh, work that you're going to be doing waterproofing. Yeah, we're going to go through one start to finish. I'm going I'm I'm to pick one out. That. Yeah. That'll be a good yeah. one. Now, now, before we let you go here, uh, the warranties on these roofs now. I mean, it, I, I mean, it's a different number than it was 10 years ago. Absolutely. We actually have the best warranty in the shingle business. Owens Corning actually backs up our labor um, and the material, and they also come out and randomly inspect our jobs. Fantastic. So we don't know which ones they're going to uh, come out and inspect, but they'll, they'll come out, they'll get up on the roof, they check our flashings, they check our nailing patterns, they make sure the shingles were installed properly, they look for the proper underlayments, and they do this all randomly. So we can't do one job better than the other. Sure. We have to do every job the same, and, um, and it's, it's the absolute best warranty in the shingle industry. So it's a, it's, it's a great, great, you have to be a platinum preferred contractor uh, through Owens Corning. So um, That's a good thing. Oh, it's a great. Well, yeah. that's why it's you've been with warranty. us since day one. That's I, right. I, I have never talked to another roofing company, and and, and I'm, I'm excited to do some of this waterproofing stuff because obviously we've had a lot of water. Yeah, we've got we've got plenty of jobs going on. Um, Going to find one for you that uh, that uh, we can learn a lot Good about on. on it. Yeah, huh? yeah, absolutely. Going to find one for you real soon. Stephen, thank you, sir. Yeah. Talk to you soon. Seagate Roofing, boy, I'll tell you what, they uh, they get it done and uh, Seagate for your home because that's it yeah. for your home. Yeah. You can do it. Yep. Thank you, sir.